Hi everybody, welcome to a food pantry haul. Um, there's like a couple boxes and a whole lot of bags of stuff and something smells a little off in one of the bags, which happens. Um, so, okay, I got a gallon of milk. It's um, a little crusty on it, but it's good till the 10th. Today is the 10th. I'm going to make some um, homemade sausage gravy, so we'll be using that today. Um, I wanted to get that done because it's sitting right here. I'm outside because it's a beautiful day. Alan's gone, and the back door is shut, and it seems how I got to go through the house with the food um, because we're having a lot of storms and stuff right now and hail and things. My camper's still in the back of the big, big part of the garage. Because it, it's to protect it. Because I don't have um, big awnings. I don't have thousands and thousands of dollars. You can't just put them up. They have to be in concrete. You know, to hold them down. They just don't set there. And I, <laughs> so it's, it's still a process. I also have two bags of apples. So we're going to set them off to the side. Um, because I put my food in the big freezer. The freezable stuff. And then I put my other groceries away where they need to. So I figured why not do it outside. It's a beautiful day. It's a comfortable temperature. Overcast, but I'll take it. So um, where do I start? Let's go ahead and do these millions of bags. It's not really millions of bags, guys. It's just bags. So this bag... It's full of pears, and I'll show you. I mean, it is all pears. There's probably one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I got 10 pears, and they're still quite hard. This bag is a mishmash. Let's see what we got. Oh my God, I love this stuffing. I had it on Easter and um, it made a huge bowl and I'm the only one that eats it, but it was pretty good. I think what I'll do the next time is only make half a bag and uh, Ziploc the rest of it. But there's a bag of stuffing. Oh, yes. Another one of these jalapeno cheese sauce mixes. We got a couple of bananas. We have an apple with a bad spot, and we have, um, like, some potatoes. Oops. And another apple. He's wanting to roll away. And then we have, whoops, Sloppy Joe and Spaghetti Mix. That bag's got a hole in it now. And then we have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it looks like 10 is the magic number. So we have some oranges. So we have 10 of those. And then we have two bags of raisins. I got raisins like this last month. And then I have some instant potatoes, which I live on potatoes, guys. And a bag of USDA walnuts. So there's those. And I got a bag of almonds. A bag of whole dates. And a bag of rice. i put this right here. And we have um, some decadent white chocolate chunk cookies. That looks good. And then we have shrimp flavored ramen. 
Ooh. Mm. You know what? He smells delicious. So we have a roast beef and cheddar sub. Four white potatoes. Some cheesy tuna. Some pancake mix. Is that open? Because there's the mayonnaise that should have been in it. It is open. Oh. Or is it just coming out? Maybe it's not open. It's just losing its contents out the side. <laughs> it's just sliding out. So we have a green pepper. Nice green pepper. And an onion. So we're going to stack them right there. And then we have, oops, strawberries, frozen cup of strawberries, some more peaches. Um, Margaret don't know how to make cobbler. So, and then we have some blueberries. All right. So let's get into this bag. This looks like toiletries. So we have some more of the uh, laundry sheets. I'm going to use that over there. One roll and two rolls of TP. We have some soft soap, liquid soap. It's been a long time since I've gotten hand soap. doesn't want to stay. There we go. And then we've got some disinfectant ready wipes. Um, they're disinfecting wipes, not hand wipes or anything. And a truck is coming up the road. So we'll wait a second until it goes by. Because it can get loud. We're going to get a little bit of dust coming through, but that's okay. Then we have two dozen of eggs. We'll just kind of set them right there. Then we have some rolls. A box of cornflakes. I don't know if you can see the dust. It's, it's here. <laughs> And frozen peas, kettle, uh, mesquite chips. Oh, it's good. Mesquite barbecue potato chips. We have nutter butter cookies, Russell Stover's Valentine's candy. A little packet of donuts and some coconut cream egg. Oh, yummy. I'm going to have that with my lunch. We have naughty pretzels. These are chili and lime. They look good. What do you think? I like that. That looks really good. Let's see. We have some apple juice and a bottle of water. Some cherry jello. Some stir hydration fruit punch. And some salted butter. We have package of pork chops and some Barras hot dogs. We got the good macaroni and cheese. That's the good stuff. I love this kind. I'll eat any macaroni and cheese in the box, but that's my favorite. Grapefruit spread. And then we have applesauce, 
cut green beans and whole kernel corn. I'm going to set these back down. Premium white chicken. Refried beans. And chicken noodle soup. We got some frozen carrots. The last bag of these were so stale that they would not cook. I cooked them for like ever and you still couldn't mush down on them. So we have some ground turkey. Um, I believe these are biscuits. Some bologna. Odd thing, I've been craving bologna sandwiches. Um, sugar. <laughs> I was like, what is this? You know, it does say right there, sugar. Um, it doesn't say how much, it just says it's sugar. So I got a bag of sugar. A couple of crackers. Some Easy Skillet Alfredo. And not one, but two pizzas. So now I got a pizza party. So I got that one upside down, but that's okay. Oh, that one is a breakfast pizza. Okay, I'm all in on that. So here we have some hot fish fillets. Definitely need some breading on those. And then we have uh, lean ground beef. And then there's some people coming up the road again. I don't know who it was. I think it was Marion. And then we have a package of pulled pork. And now we have cheese, a brick of cheese. Let me slide that out of the way and get to this box. Let's just put this in my lap. Must bend me over. Spaghetti sauce, peaches, another can of spaghetti sauce, peanut butter. What do we got here? applesauce and then more salmon and then we have two little bitty applesauces cream of chicken soup big can of pink salmon hot green beans where's the front of the can whole kernel corn um, traditional low sodium pasta sauce. I got told spaghetti sauce and pasta sauce are different. And then we have another can of cut green beans and uh, seven in one mixed vegetables. So there's a can of mixed vegetables. And that is all. It's a pretty short um, haul compared to last week's or last month's, but that's okay. Um, got a lot of good stuff. The pizza's going to be amazing. Um, that's the first time I've ever gotten a breakfast pizza. So everybody, thank you so much for hanging out with me outside. Now my hands are frozen from the frozen foods. And I like doing this here because things go in different directions and the back door is shut. So... <laughs> It actually makes it easier. Plus, I went to a um, estate sale. Oh, my gosh. The prices were stupid, crazy high. Like, higher than they were at the store. Like, them three packs of, uh, you know, little things you put stuff in from the Dollar Tree. They were like 25 They had $2 for two of them. Um, the, the price of the little totes from the Dollar Tree, you know, little... Things with the plastic lids on them, the plastic clear things with the little lids. They wanted like three, four dollars a piece for them, and they're a buck twenty-five at the dollar store. I mean, the prices were crazy. Um, I, 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 I did buy a couple things, but it wasn't a lot, and it was just a couple things that I needed. 
Then I went to the Dollar Tree and actually bought a few things. And then I went to Walmart and picked up a few things um, that I had to have. So um, really, I, I didn't spend any money that I didn't need to spend. And I, I missed out on a couple of card tables I would have liked to have had. But they had them set aside. So somebody apparently saw them and wanted them or messaged them or something and if you say no sales then please don't sell stuff early or set stuff aside for people before the sale that's kind of how i feel you know but that's okay so i was like okay anyways i'm gonna get off here and i'll talk to all of you guys down in the comments below bye everybody